So now we are going to work on our post defense and what we call our choke. So the ball's going to be thrown right here. We're going to, the ball's going to start here. Here's the drill. Offensively, please pay attention. We're going to feed the post. So you're going to feed it. Now, you're not going to cut. Each guy is going to feed it two times. So the first time you're going to feed it and just stay spaced. So take it right here. Feed it. Stay spaced. Now, we're going to work on choking the post. And what I want to do, what I call choking the post, is with the ball side guy and the top guy are down here choking it out of the post. So we're going to be right here. If the ball's in here already, throw it in here. I would prefer to get your butt to the baseline, if we can, on choking the post. And we're just right here. Once he dribbles it, just take a dummy. We're trying to get that thing out of there. And then we're going to throw it back. You're going to close right back again. You're going to throw it again. And then you're going to cut. You're going to cut. You're coming over here. This guard's coming here. Remember, we still got to do what? Every time a guy cuts through our paint, we got to tag him. All right? And you're coming right here. I mean, it's tough. Like, you're trying to fight for the choke, okay? And, doesn't, and then you're going to follow him through. And then when he comes out here, you're right here. Now, we're still doing what? So let's take it all the way back. Take it all the way back. Well, we still got to choke the post even though he's cutting. So let's say he throws it in. All right, he cuts. Let's say he cuts right here. You got to go with him. Now you become a choke guy. Your guy comes right up here. Your guy becomes a choke guy. Does that make sense? So we're kind of right here choking, and you're going to be right here. So if the ball is thrown out right here, you got to do what? Stun at him. But we're not going to do that, but that's why you got you to be right there. So the next guy coming over is choking. And this guy's choking, okay? So the first time, each guy's going to feed it two times. So let's take it back. Let's start the whole thing all over again. Yep, three-quarter in the post. Yep, three-quarter in the post. Post up, Bailey, three-quarter, just, just not live. Three-quarters on the high side. Yep, just like that. Good. Each guy's going to feed it twice. Good. Feed it. Choke, choke, dig it out. Close it again. Now cut. Everybody's got to tag him. Good, now feed it and stay spaced, stay spaced. Good, throw it back out, close out, throw it in, cut, tag them, tag them. Good, 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 choke, choke, good, throw it out. Good, in there, choke. Good, that's good, that's good, 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 good. Everybody throws it through two times. Okay, let's do it again, let's do it again. When the last guy, what's your name? When Lino throws it in on the second one, we play it live. Everybody plays it live. So you're going to throw it in, and you're going to cut, and then Bailey, you're going to play it live. You're probably not going to make your move when he's cutting, okay? All right, here we go. Same thing again. Post choke. Good. Choke. Get it out of there. Good. Cut. Tag. Good. Choke. 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 Choke it out. Good. Good. Choke it out. Tag. Good. Close it out. Good. One more time. Throw it in. Now we're playing it live. Play it live. Play it live. Good move, Bailey. Good. Nice job. Very nice. The next form, the next drill is what we just call our post trap. And we do our post trap five on five. We don't believe in breaking it down because there's so many pieces that involve uh, the post trap. But we feel the post trap allows us to defend a post player maybe that's better than anybody we have. Or we also like trapping a player that maybe not as good, where you can maybe turn him over uh, and make make tough basketball plays. So how we practice our post trap is a very simple three out, two in. So the offense will pass it around. When the ball's thrown into the post, the defensive player immediately goes to the baseline side, who the original post defender, and then the other post defender, which in this case would be our five man, he is coming over with high hands and we're trapping the post. 